Hello, this is Dr. Adam Kopsky from Advanced Rabbit Medical, and today I just want to go over uh, a few tips on uh, the chiropractic uh, literature, in particular as it pertains to low back pain. Uh, and if you guys didn't know, September is uh, the Chiropractic Nation National Pain Awareness Month, and so time to time I like to be on here and uh, scour what the literature says uh, about musculoskeletal pain. And today I have this great infograph and I'm actually going to be attaching this to the video uh, when we're finished and also I have them in the office so if you guys ever want any more information about what the current literature says please come in this month we'll have this going all month long we'll have them at the rehab station uh, in the office so feel free to grab one and share them but I just want to read a couple things and talk about low back pain so Musculoskeletal pain, as it pertains to low back pain, there's a bunch of many different causes of low back pain, but 97% of all low back pain is mechanical in nature, meaning it's coming from soft tissue, whether it be muscles, tendons, ligaments, uh, and even degenerative changes. And so what the research has, has shown right here in the medical journals is that actually for acute low back pain, NSAIDs, Tylenol, and then NSAIDs would be, uh, that would be your Advil, uh, Aleve, and then muscle relaxers, they actually show no relevance uh, in, the, in acute low back pain. And from the pain journal, they had showed Tylenol is ineffective for acute low back pain, even for patients who comply with treatment. Another article from the European Journal of Pain uh, stated that a large research of more than 3,300 patients reported there is no evidence for the efficiency of benzos as it pertains to low back pain. However, when we look at the scientific literature about chiropractic and manip uh, manipulative therapy as well as manual therapy, they've actually found that 56 patients versus 13 reported that their low back pain was better or much better, whereas one third of those, approximately 33% reported their low back pain was worse or much worse. So this just uh, it goes to show you that if you're a candidate for musculoskeletal for uh, treatment in the manual therapy if you have back pain that is mechanical in nature that research shows that uh, chiropractic manipulation does work and so of course there's going to be outliers there's not one size fits all so of course the first step is getting evaluated to see if we can help or if an, another physician uh, would be the, the right route to go so I hope this is informative uh, please feel free to uh, to look at this infograph in more detail in the video and then please feel free to ask us questions and grab an office I hope this was informative and you guys have a great rest of the week. Thank you.